Well, in Argentina, international education leaders gathered for a seminar in solidarity, learning and service. The event organized by the Latin American Center for Service Learning took place at the Catholic University in Argentina. The project also received Vatican support through the Congregation for Catholic Education. Joining us now from Buenos Aires, Argentina, is Maria Neves Tapia, founder and director of CLEAS, the Latin American Center for Service Learning. Maria Neves, thank you so much for your time today. We appreciate it. Uh, can you tell us more about this meeting and what was the main purpose? Uh, thank you for having me. Uh, we have just finished uh, last week our 25th annual service learning conference. It started being a very small Argentinian conference and in the last year has begun to become a, a worldwide conference. Uh, this year we had people from the five continents, from the Philippines to Kenya to Taiwan to Palestine, and of course Europe, the US, Latin America. So we, we are very happy because we had around 400 people on site and around 1,000 people connected online. So it, it was really a, a global gathering around the idea of uh, service and learning and how any kind of institutional, uh, educational institution can help their students not only to, to learn how to serve, but to use their knowledge, their heads, hands and hearts to transform reality. And I understand that you recently had contact with Archbishop Zwani of the Congregation for Catholic Education. Uh, if you don't mind, can you tell us about that and also how the church and the Vatican are involved in your projects? Uh, well, uh, as you know, Pope Francis made a, a universal call for the Global Compact on Education. And one of the pillars of the Global Compact on Education is learning fraternity. So service learning is one of the pedagogies that the, uh, the church has embraced to promote learning fraternity. So those of us who have been working with service learning for many years are, are really happy to, to make this connection. Uh, CLIS, as the Latin American Center for Service Learning, serves any kind of institution, confessional or not, uh, public, uh, private. But we have been working especially with, with Catholic schools and Catholic universities in the past few years around the Global Compact on Education. Because service learning is the pedagogy that helps uh, concrete the call for fraternity. And finally, before I let you go, uh, in October, an event on solidarity service learning uh, will take place in Rome with about 100 Catholic universities. What more can you tell us about that? Uh, Unicervitate is one of the programs we are running with, with, in collaboration with Porticus. It's a program focusing uh, Catholic universities around the world wanting to introduce service learning as part of their institutional policies. And we will gather in Rome um, rectors, presidents, authorities of the universities, but also uh, professors, teachers, and students. We, we made a call this year to a Unicervitate Award to recognize the best practices around the world and the representatives of each region, the winners of the Unicevitati Award will be also in Rome in this conference that will take place in the last week in October. Well, Maria Nieves, thank you so much for your time today. We really appreciate it. God bless you.